And get over your own ego. Get over your own arrogance. Ego will destroy you. Ego is what you do. Arrogance is what you refuse to do. Ego and arrogance are based on emotion. Emotion sits between thought and action. All that space between what you thought about or what you did is filled with emotion. Anything you put emotion in front of is magnified. So if you put emotion in front of your problems, they seem bigger than what they really are. If you put emotion in front of your solutions, it seems bigger than what it really is, better than what it really is. So keep emotion out of it. How do you control emotion? Have a checklist. Have a process. Have a set order. Remove the ability between, remove that space between action, or between thought and action. Have you done this yet? I was going to, but then I thought about, oh, we're done. We're ruined. We're screwed. Why hasn't, well, you know, I was getting ready to, but then I thought, if you follow a process, follow a checklist, follow an order, there is no thought. In the military, if we thought too much, people died. People died. If I'm jumping out of an airplane and I have to think about pulling my ripcord, mm, I don't know now is the right time. Maybe, why is this leather? Shouldn't this be like a polyurethane mix or something? <laughs> Bam! Now I hit the ground. Because I was too busy thinking. But the process is, you go out. In fact, the military is smart. Depending on what level of paratrooper you are, you've got, you're tethered. It'll pull it for you, because it doesn't want you thinking about it. So it does it for you. <clears throat> Remove that space between thought and action by putting processes in place, by putting schedules in place, by putting a set way of doing things in place, and that will remove the emotion which will stop you from doing many of the things that you're doing and not doing the things that you're supposed to be doing. 